Hello everyone, welcome to this video. If you are new here, karibu sana and kindly consider subscribing for more crochet videos. In today's video, we are going to learn how to crochet shoelaces in a simplest way. So to start, First, you have to determine the length of your shoelace and for me I'm going to crochet about 26 inches that means uh, I will start with with the 120 chains so make a slip knot like that insert your hook and make 120 chains one two three four five six seven eight nine ten once you're done making 120 chains i'll show you what to do next I'm done making the chains. Next step, skip this first chain from the hook and the second chain make a slip stitch. To make a slip stitch, insert your hook in the second chain from the hook grab yarn and pull through to this side next insert your hook in the next chain grab yarn and pull through this is how you make slip stitch next next chain make a slip stitch so you will be making slip stitches in every chain slip stitch slip stitch in every chain to these are the end That's how simple it is to make shoelaces. Just chains and slip stitches. So continue making slip stitches in every chain to the end of this row. The last chain, then make one chain and tighten off. And then you cut a big long tail. Use a yarn needle to hide these tails so that it doesn't run off.
So we are done and here is our shoelace. He is about 26 inches long. Another way you can make a simple shoelace is by combining two strands of yarn. Two strands of yarn. Make a slip knot. And then make chains. To, to get this length and this size, that is why I have combined two yarns, two strands. I'll get similar size. And the length will be 26 inches with 110 chains. So once you've made your slip knot, make chains to your desired length. For me, I'm going to make 110. One, two, three, four, five, six. I have 110 chains here. Cut your yarn and tighten off. Then use your yarn needle to hide these tails, just like we did on these other shoelaces. That is all about making shoelaces. So you can choose one method that is easier for you, either the slip stitches or just chains by combining two strands of yarn. Thank you for, for watching and kindly remember to subscribe if you haven't. Till next time, bye!